Hello, and welcome to The Monster Painter. This week, I'm going to paint up the three-headed troll from the Reaper Bones 5 Kickstarter. And I want you to watch to the end of the video because you could win the very first piece of Monster Painter swag ever created. How exciting. All right, let's get started. This uh, three-headed troll here is from the Bones 5 Kickstarter, which I received last month. And he is definitely my favorite model in the entire core set. He's done in the Bones Black material, which is uh, very much superior to the old Bones material. It holds detail better and is much less susceptible to the dreaded pool noodle whip weapon syndrome. My only uh, quibble with this excellent sculpt is that it looks nothing like the Three Stooges, who were immortalized in a legendary and hard-to-find Rawl Partha three-headed troll back in uh, 1979, which was later recalled because Rawl Partha didn't have the licenses license to uh, produce the likenesses of the Three Stooges, which uh, makes this old Rawl Partha miniature a lot harder to find. It's rarer and a little more collectible, but uh, you know this this uh, three-headed troll is still pretty co cool. Now, as for those. Uh, venerable vaudevillians the uh the three stooges i didn't know this but uh, apparently they made the first american film to mock hitler called uh you you nazi spy in 1940. it was released four months before charlie chaplin's the great dictator another excellent movie hitler was so insulted by this mockery from the stooges that he put them on his personal hit list. And of course, anybody who can piss off old dumb Dolph that much to get, uh, to get uh, uh, put on the assassination list is good with me. Um, now, the Three Stooges, they were uh, hard partying fellows. And uh, Curly, in particular, had a soft spot for stray dogs. Apparently, he would uh, frequently find a stray when he was traveling for work, adopt it, bring it home, rehabilitate it, and then later adopt it out to somebody else. Um, a very sweet thing to do. Surprisingly, Curly was also quite the ladies' man. Once again, demonstrating that women love a man who is funny, famous, and kind to animals. Good old Curly. All right, enough of those. Uh, enough about those silly old uh, vaudevillians. Um, I gotta say, I really love this model. It's got a lot of character. I mean, he's uh, angry. He's got his tongue lolling out. He's got a teddy bear and a barrel of rum. These are the kinds of things that every monster needs if he's gonna go smashing those heroes. Um, I don't have much else to say about him. But um, there's still a lot of video to go, so uh, that means it's time to cue some music from my good friend Angus, who has provided me with a couple of tunes to fill out this video. So uh, relax and enjoy the painting and the beats, and I'll catch you at the other end. <laughs>
And here's another set of beats from Angus. at the final result this uh fabulous three-headed troll painted up real easy he's got tons of character his own teddy bear a barrel of rum and the will to smash the hell out of anybody who gets in his way i gotta say i just love this model wow you made it through that painting video that means you must really want this monster painter dice bag the first piece of monster painter swag ever created made by my lovely and talented sister and this could be yours all you have to do is leave a comment in the comment section down below let me know which uh, monster or or model from the uh, bones five core set you'd like to see me paint next or uh, if you are uninterested in uh, the Bones 5 core set, then uh, leave a comment telling me what kind of content you would like to see on the Monster Painter in future videos. I'm going to put all the uh, names of the commenters in a hat, and then on Tuesday, August 24th, I'm going to pull one of those names out of the hat, and uh, then I'll go from there. I'll figure out a way to contact the winner, and I'll mail this lovely math rock bag to that lucky person. So, uh, yeah, get commenting. Next week on The Monster Painter, I dig through a $90 box of dusty old miniatures. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe.
the monster painter.